and uh, we are at one of the approximately 180,000 Anganwadi centers in the state of UP itself. Now the Anganwadi centers provide many kinds of services, but specifically these tools which are used to help track children and their nutrition levels. So are they malnourished, are they not, are they severely malnourished or are they moderately malnourished. But what is most interesting about this Anganwadi Center and the state of UP or in India is this portion tracker. It's an app which was introduced in about 2020 and it provides very easy access not just to the Anganwadi workers to keep track of the multiple beneficiaries or children or mothers that they keep track of but instead of using the manual register that we've seen with my travels with UNICEF um, in many parts of the world that is used this portion tracker is an incredible way to see how technology and innovation can change lives at scale now if you look at the beneficiaries the beneficiaries are pregnant women, lactating mothers, children um, at younger ages, children that are older ages. But what you can do is say, for example, we go to the children. It'll tell you if these children are, they say, Sam or Ma'am, which is severely, acutely malnourished or moderately malnourished or healthy. So if we look at Jay Lakshmi, for example, and we see it, it shows that she is ma'am, which is moderately malnourished. Her stunting is normal. She is underweight. And that will immediately tell you right here at the app. And it's easy for the Anganwadi worker to see and track the children and the growth of these children across time. So these Anganwadi workers specifically go to people's homes to advocate and talk to children and their parents to send children to primary school.